I start my arm locks with the side control, first thing I need, I need a good side control. Make sure I pin him down well, I'm controlling the neck and the legs and the head down, then I have a good side control. Now, it's time to look for his arm. If you put arm around my shoulder to try to keep the arm in a safe place, I have to take that arm. So then I go elbow over, elbow over. Make sure you control your opponent between your elbows and knees. So don't let him skate. Now I go one hand over the bicep, second hand, then I work on my posture. At the same time, I drop his elbow down. Now I have his arm. Okay? To apply the key lock, I grab his wrist, put it down on the floor. My opposite hand goes underneath his bicep. I grab my own wrist. Okay? Remember, I'm always holding with my fingers and thumb together and I have more leverage this way. The way to twist the arm now is bring the arm towards the ribs. Make sure you keep his wrist down and then you can lift the elbow up. Don't try to do the key lock up here. This is the wrong angle. You're not going to succeed here. Okay? Hold the wrist down and put the elbow towards his rib. And then you can twist a good key lock. If my opponent is stronger and he feels I want to bend his arm, he'll try to straight the arm. Okay? What I'm going to do now, I'm going to lean forward, slide my hand around the wrist, and take the arm straight. Okay? I'm going to switch for the straight arm bar. Okay? I have to put my fingers in the same line as his thumb. Okay? And my forearm underneath his elbow. And now I bring the elbow up and push the wrist down. Then I have a straight arm bar. From here, if you try to twist arm again, I can bring him back to the key lock. 